Hello, everybody. This is Drew uh, with Acoustic Collectibles. Welcome back to a brand new video. Uh, I normally deal a lot with tone numismatics, um, tone Morgan dollars, and other tone stuff that I can get my hands on. So in this video, I'll be showing you a few tone Morgan dollars, a few things I've already sold on Instagram, just some things that uh, you guys might find interesting. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. And yeah, let's get it started. Hey guys, just wanted to show you all uh, some new things that I've got in recently. Um, it's just a lot of Morgan dollars and a few other newer kind of things. Um, as of late, I've been trying to move into kind of wholesaling and uh, also buying more rare stuff to, to offer my customers. So uh, I wanted to show off a few cool coins today. This is an 1884 O Morgan dollar. And the cool thing about this is the deep greens, yellows, and reds. It's kind of like a Barney feel to it, and you can also see the bag toning right here, and the bag toning kind of going up above the head. Uh, you know, toning like this is pretty uh, difficult to get sometimes, especially in an OGH holder, which is, you know, the old green holder. Um, the CAC sticker, uh, and this coin's got it all. It's really beautiful. I don't know, I really, really like this coin, and so when I saw it, I paid up for it, but I knew I'd find a customer for it. So this coin is going to be paid for tomorrow. And the customer will have this brand new coin in their collection. Um, it's just really hard to find toned coins like this sometimes for an, a reasonable price. They're out there, but sometimes it's like I said, it's a little bit more difficult. But I wanted to show you guys this first coin just because it's a beautiful one. And uh, let's hop into the next one. So this one was bought from the same dealer down in uh, Texas. Um, this is an 1881S, received a CAC sticker and the star designation, and you're about to see why. Uh, when I lift it up to the light, uh, you could just see this beautiful violet, beautiful green, and kind of beautiful auburn type of toning to it. Uh, this this coin kind of blew my socks off. The luster is very beautiful. It's an 1881S, so it's to be expected. Um, but it's just an, a beautiful coin in hand. Um, stuff like this, I really like to mess around with. Even if I, the thing about it is, even if I don't sell this coin, right? Like, say, I have trouble selling this coin or finding a buyer for it. Um, I don't mind holding it. I don't mind take, picking it up every day, having a look at it, figuring out where is a good place to sell it. So this coin is amazing, immaculate. I'm so thankful I bought this coin. Um, and I'm excited to find someone that will love it just as much as I do. So now let's move into the next coin. This coin I found on eBay. Um, it's a 1923 uh, piece dollar. You're like, oh, just blast away, uh, yuck, right? Um, for this video, yuck, because we're trying to show off toning. But if I flip it over, you could start to see the rainbow bullseye toning on the reverse. So I, I'm kind of used to color progression and seeing it through crappy photos. So when I saw this, it was kind of like this a little bit, or kind of like, I don't know, it was really hard to see. It was kind of like this on eBay. So when I saw it, I'm like, yeah, that's that's the, what's what I need. That's what I want to buy. So I bought it instantly, sent them an offer, it accepted. And just the reason why coins like this are hard, like it's it's not like the 1881S. So let me pull the 18. It's not like Tony like this you're going to find on a piece dollar. Just because of the coating that was put on by the US Mint to avoid tarnishing. So when a coin actually tones, it hasn't been cleaned and retoned like this coin, it's an extremely rare occurrence with peace dollars. And so when I bought this coin and uh, when I received it in hand, I was blown away. And once again, I don't, I don't mind keeping this coin. I didn't pay too much for it. And then when it sells, I'm gonna be making good money because I bought it at the right price and I bought it with crappy photos like this. And then when someone buys it, they're like, wow, this straight graded, it's straight graded mint state. And it's just a beautiful piece of history. Um, finding toned piece dollars like this um, will run you like four or five hundred dollars on a good day. Um, but just an amazing coin. And we're going to move into a few more Morgan dollars uh, before we wrap up today's video. This is another star designation, 1885 O Morgan dollar. Um, I found. I was trying to buy this coin from some someone on Instagram, and then someone else beat me to it. 
And then when they, that person finally sent it in and got it holdered, I'm like, can I buy it from you now? And they're like, yeah. So this coin is also a pretty, pretty nice monster. The only reason why like, the toning is on the reverse, which you kind of try to avoid, but I, I mean, I, I bought a bunch of them. But this coin's color progression is very, very beautiful. So you could see kind of the blue going in, the gold, the red, then the blue, then the green, and back to that auburn, you kind of see that same kind of pattern for many coins. But this coin's extremely beautiful because of that, I don't know, it's just very interesting. And what I really like about this coin is that it's got like this red eagle, the eagle's red and yellow kind of. And I really, really like that aspect of the coin. And so when I found this coin uh, and he was trying to sell it, I'm like, hey, bro, like I'll buy it. I don't care. And so when I bought it. Uh, paid a little bit more than I normally would for these types of grades and stars on it, but I love the coin and I wouldn't mind trying to find a customer for it. So it's just an immaculate coin. Really love the toning on it. And uh, let's move into the next coin. So this is the last of the Morgan dollars. I also found this coin on eBay. It's an 1882s. A little bit tougher of a date sometimes to find with toning. Uh, it's got this interesting like. I don't know, loops going into the coin. I think it was held in like a holder or a plastic or something like that. Uh, the luster is really nice, but the reverse is kind of what I wanted to show you today. Um, this coin was up for auction, had crappy photos, and I'm like, I think this coin will be beautiful in hand. And once again, you're going back to that very strange color. So it's kind of like orange, red, blue, and green. And so most coins you don't see with that type of toning and it has like this textile feel as well to it. So it's a really, really beautiful um, coin with decent color and a decent grade. And so I'm like, you know what? I didn't pay too much for this coin either. Let me try to find a buyer for it and see what they say. And so I just got this in this week. It's a really, really, really nice coin. And I can't wait to find a new customer for it. And I'm gonna show you guys one last coin before today's video is over. Um, this is an 1861 half dime and this coin I found at a show um, the obverse is not the prettiest and it's sunken in this old holder it's got like some orange toning on uh, the obverse which is not too pretty uh, but when I saw the reverse I was like I have to buy this coin so I found this coin at the show it's got like this it's really hard to pick up because of this uh, old holder and has a lot of scratches on it um, but this coin was found at a show uh, has this blue, gold, and red toning to it. I'm gonna have to just move it away some. Um, but it's it's an immaculate coin. I really do like it. I paid under what uh, most collectors would buy it for, and then I'm gonna kind of try to find a price guide for it and see where where I could sell it at. Most of these coins sell for like 135, 150, and the toning on it is just really, really nice. So, thank you guys for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I wanted to show you guys just a few things about uh, my business and what I work with and just the things that I like to surround myself with every day. Uh, just a really nice group of Morgan dollars and that half time was pretty cool too. So hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe in this video. Uh, it would really, really mean a lot. So thank you guys.